Number seven, Tamara Penitentiary, Honduras. This institution serves as a stark example of how dangerous a woman's prison can be. Not just because of the extreme tactics employed by the guards, but also due to the violence among inmates. Tonight, anguish and anger in Honduras after government officials say a gang slaughtered at least 46 women inside a prison. In June of 2023, some inmates at this penitentiary were reporting threats of violence from local gangs known as Maras, but the prison didn't take any steps to protect them. On the night of June 20th, inmates from one of the gangs overpowered the guards and set fire to the facility. The fire caused dozens of deaths and many other women were shot and stabbed during the riot. This incident left nearly 50 women dead, making it one of the deadliest prison riots in history. While joining a gang might seem like a way to stay safe in prison, cases like this prove the opposite. It's safer to steer clear of trouble and report any threats from violent groups to authorities. Today, we're taking you to the most dangerous women's prisons on Earth. If you think surviving in these places would be a breeze, think again. You won't believe what happens behind these walls. Which prison forced its inmates to have sex with guards? How did prisoners take control of one facility? And which prison has a long history of mysterious deaths? But before we dive into these violent prisons, let's make a quick stop in another dark and dangerous place. The internet! You know, using a powerful VPN protects us from viruses and other threats and allows us to bypass location restrictions in order to bring you the most extreme survival stories from around the world. And when I'm traveling to locations that don't have my favorite streaming services, well, I use Surfshark so that I can still watch my favorite shows from back home. Surfshark is the easiest VPN service I've ever used. And if you click on the link in the description below, you can get an exclusive Surfshark VPN holiday season deal. Enter our promo code, how to survive, to get six additional months for free at surfshark.deals slash how to survive. And after that, if you're still cautious, don't worry. There's no risk in trying Surfshark VPN. They offer a 30 day money back guarantee. If you need even more protection, you can grab the Surfshark One package, which includes Surfshark Alert, Search, and Antivirus. Okay, now that you're protected, let's go check out these dangerous prisons. Number six, La Mesa Prison, Mexico. This prison is situated in Tijuana, a city in Northern Mexico that's known for, among other things, drug trafficking and the violence associated with it. And just like the city, La Mesa's inmates are known to be tough and ruthless, leading to frequent and deadly riots. One of the most severe incidents there occurred in 2008 when guards denied water to inmates following a riot that had claimed the lives of three prisoners. In protest, some inmates climbed to the top of the building and took control of the facility. Authorities eventually intervened, resulting in the deaths of 19 women and injuries to many others during the operation. Experts and journalists attribute this tragic event to corruption and negligence within the prison system and local government. Unfortunately, there's not much a prisoner can do to combat these issues. Want to visit a facility that's completely run by the inmates? Well, check out our video, The Top 5 Weirdest Prisons. You have a key to your own cell. Yeah, everybody has their own key. And subscribe to our channel for more locked up content. Number 5, Julia Tutwiler Prison, United States. This institution in Alabama, which opened in 1942, has gained notoriety in recent years for its severe overcrowding and the alarming incidents of sexual abuse committed by both inmates and prison officers. A group called the Equal Justice Initiative released a report on Tutwiler claiming to have spoken with more than 50 inmates 
many of whom said they had been sexually abused by prison guards. According to a 2014 report, officers have demanded sexual favors in exchange for clean uniforms and conducted irregular headcounts in the showers. As many as 36% of the staff have been identified as engaging in sexual intercourse with inmates, often non-consensual. The misconduct was so appalling that in 2016, the governor of Alabama announced the prison's closure. However, it continues to operate today, and there's no evidence to suggest that the abuse has stopped. Number 4. Lowell Prison, United States Lowell opened its doors in 1956 as the first female prison in Florida and has since become the largest women's prison in the United States, housing nearly 3,000 inmates. But despite being overcrowded with women sentenced for murder, sex crimes, and drug trafficking, the biggest threat might be the abusive prison staff. Former inmates have spoken openly about being forced to have sex with guards to avoid being put in solitary confinement. Some prisoners died under suspicious circumstances after reporting harassment by personnel, their families receiving little explanation. Number 3. Bangalore Central Prison, India This place was initially built as a prison for men, but later added a section for women. It currently houses more than 200 women, some of whom have come forward to share the terrible things they've been through. In 2014, a group of prisoners sent two letters stating that they were suffering sexual exploitation by the prison authorities. According to the letters, the women were taken to the men's section of the prison and forced to have sex with inmates who had paid off the guards. Prison authorities denied the allegations, but the government stepped in and ordered an investigation. Number 2. Heilongjiang Women's Prison, China Despite the Chinese government's secrecy surrounding this facility, an incident in 2023 revealed the systematic abuse that inmates endure. Mua Yangsha, a 75-year-old woman, died while being hit by the guards and other inmates. She had previously reported being tortured by prison guards in their attempt to get her to renounce her faith, known as Falun Gong. According to Human Rights Watch, this faith has been persecuted in China for at least the last two decades. Some reports claim that at least 5,000 practitioners of this faith have died due to their imprisonment and government negligence. Number 1. The Metro State Prison for Women, United States This prison in Georgia, inaugurated in 1980 as a male prison and converted into a women's facility in 1992, quickly became one of the most troubled prisons in the U.S. and around the world. Aside from having a large population of individuals sentenced to death or life imprisonment, a significant portion of the conflicts in this prison revolved around sexual encounters. An ABC News investigation revealed that up to 90% of the inmates had engaged in sexual intercourse with other prisoners, leading to conflicts and violence. Due to the harsh conditions of imprisonment, many inmates attempted to take their own lives, some succeeding, such as Lynn Turner, who, in an effort to escape the prison's horrific conditions, overdosed on blood pressure medication. The center finally closed in 2011 and its population was transferred to other state facilities. Prison life is undoubtedly challenging, but just imagine being kept captive under the worst possible conditions in solitary confinement. It's not an uncommon nightmare. Around 80,000 people in the United States are currently subjected to isolation imprisonment. If you want to learn how to survive your own mind in the hole, check out the next video here on How to Survive.